hello friends today i am going to show you how we can secure backups um, without using tde you know that uh, in 2018 we have a password option to protect the our backups at rest here uh, in 2012 we have tde but coming from 2014 onwards uh, that you don't want to enable the tde but encryption uh, we can take the backups using encryption keyword so encryption is uh, not recognized keyword in 2012 so let's test the, all these scenario one by one now click execute so now i am taking one of the dba which is not encrypted so before uh, to uh, to be on safe side i am taking this backup okay so dba 2020 i'm taking 2022 uh, that's the reason i just named that like that so it got uh, to be on safe side i have taken the full backup before uh, encrypting itself i am creating the master key okay so and i am creating a certificate for tde especially okay and i am create uh, i am attaching that encryption key uh, okay and done see now it got this error that not has been not backup okay now i am taking this uh, backup it got done now if i done this option when we are enabling tde on the dba database but i am not doing this even though if i see here is encrypted see where dba is equal to zero only okay so now now what I want to do here is I, I have just another command backup database DBA to disk is equal to something compression encryption is equal to uh, like what are the algorithm name that you want you can use server certificate like stat is equal to 10 this is the command that I want to use to encrypt my backups okay, I am using this certificate only okay and now just click execute it is done okay so now i am taking one one more uh, sql server instance which is 22 okay i want to just uh, try to restore that uh, to make sure what kind of error that we are uh, we might get okay so now go to d drive db22 So DBA 20 in the C drive, right? Okay. So in the C drive, oh, in the C drive, see, I got this error. Now, if I see, cannot find certificate with thumb print, restore header only, is terminating abnormally. We used to get this error. Copy this message and I am pasting here okay so for better visibility now so i can do this from sql server 2014 onwards i can take this and grab but what about if i want to do the same in 2022 let's do that uh, that as well so i am disconnecting this time i am i am taking server sql server new query and paste it here uh, that is not required i am creating one master key i am creating um, certificate i am doing that one this is done i have not done i am not doing this anything okay so if i do this okay now i got this now what I will do, I will use the same command. I am coming here. So here I am just 2000. Just if I do this thing. See, encryption is a not recognized backup option. In 2012, if you want to enable this encryption option, 
okay you, in order to protect the backups you have you need to add compulsory error but in real time like uh, is the database use it will take time to get encrypted so meanwhile uh, this encryption keyword will be useful in order to secure backups okay so this is the one of the way without enabling tde we can uh, use the certificates uh, to protect the our backups at rest i hope uh, you may like our video thank you bye